everyone, welcome and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be trying the Authentic Beauty Concept Replenish Hair Mask. So this is great for damaged hair, but my hairdresser in Columbus, Ohio, actually gave me a sample of it because they switched over to this brand a little while ago and she wanted me to give one of their products a try. So I actually have enjoyed it so far. Um, this is the first time that I've used it and I used it today. My hair is still wet. I have styled my hair and I'm letting it air dry right now. So my hair is still pretty wet, but I will show you all what my hair looks like at the end when it is completely dry. And in this video, I'll show you how I applied it and what I thought about it along the way and what my first impressions were. So um, this does have really good ingredients in it. It has maple and pecan nut in it. It has soy protein. So a lot of things that help to smooth your hair and make it silky and soft. And then if you use this over time, it is supposed to strengthen your hair as well. So before we get started with the tutorial and the review, I do want to show you all what my hair looked like before I washed my hair. So this is what I was working with. Um, it wasn't very dry, but it has been in a ponytail for some time and I just wanted to go ahead and do a clarifying and detox mask and um, just gave it the works before putting this hair mask in it. And then at the end, you'll get to see what it looks like once it is completely dry and I've used the hair mask and my styling products. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so I have washed and conditioned my hair and now it's time to go in with the mask. And again, I'm using the Authentic Beauty Concept Replenish Mask. And this is also great for damaged hair, but I am really wanting to see if this will help my hair to become softer and shinier after using it. And it's also supposed to strengthen your hair. So if I do like this today, I will repurchase it and I will continue to use it to see if it also strengthens my hair, but we'll go ahead and see how this works. So first, let's just check the consistency here. So it is very thick. They do have a lighter version, um, a lighter hair mask that you can use if you don't like the thickness of this one, but it is super thick. So um, we'll see how that works on my hair. And I did use Innersense to wash and condition my hair. And then we'll see, like, there are still a little bit of tangles in my hair as well. So we'll see how well this detangles my hair. And my hair is drying a little bit. So I'm going to add some warm water to it. And the reason I'm using warm water is because I want my hair cuticles to stay open so that it can absorb the product, especially since I have um, low porosity hair. So I'm using, I grabbed about this much and we'll see if I need more after that. So we'll see, maybe I can get a couple uses out of this product just because it's so thick. I'm gonna add a little bit more to the ends and I'm just smoothing it through. And then after you add this to each section of your hair, so I did put my hair in sections, um, you will want to leave it in your hair for five to 10 minutes. And again, since I have low porosity hair, I am going to sit under the dryer on warm heat um, to really let this absorb into my hair over that five to 10 minutes. And I am actually gonna stay under for 10 minutes. So I'll give it the maximum time to really absorb into my hair. Oh my gosh, excuse my voice. I've been losing my voice all week. All right, and we're almost done here. I just have a couple more sections in the back. So I really am not using a lot of this product at all. So I think I should be able to get like maybe three uses out of this. We'll just see, my, the back of my hair is thicker and usually drier. So I'm gonna add a little bit more to the back. And then we'll see how much we have left. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna go in again with this section. And even though it felt thick while I was like, when I pull it out of the container, when I put it into my hair, it has really good slip. It feels really good going into the hair. Definitely can tell that this is going to be moisturizing. It feels amazing. 
and it smells really good too. So although this product is not 100%, um, it's not natural, um, it does have uh, a preservative in it that isn't natural and then some other ingredients that aren't as well. Uh, it does rank pretty well if you look at it on Think Dirty. The number says eight, but when you look at the ingredients, it's just because the fragrance ranks at, ranks at an eight. So that always puts it at an eight, but that's just because they usually don't disclose what's in the fragrance. So although we don't know what's in it, um, I do not think it would really be at an eight, but who knows? All right. And we still have about three fourths of the product left. So we're in good shape here. And you can see how nice my hair is looking, how moisturized it looks. This feels so, so good. And I don't think I'll have a problem with this being too heavy either. So I'm really excited to see what it looks like once I'm done. And then after I sit under the dryer, um, that's when I'm going to detangle my hair. So I will come back on and I will show you all whether it is easier to detangle my hair after applying this product. Because even with the slip that it has right now, I feel like it is helping to get rid of some of the tangles, but as you can see, there are still tangles in my hair. So I think that 10 minutes will definitely help with loosening those tangles up. All right, oh, let me add some water here. Okay, so I have applied this to my entire head now and I am just going to pin it up into two sections. And then I'm going to put a shower cap on and sit under the dryer for, again, 10 minutes. So. I will be right back. Okay, now we can see how well this product performed. So the product is still in my hair and my hair is still feeling a little warm from the dryer, but let's see if these tangles have loosened more. It definitely feels like it has in the front. Oh my gosh. And definitely in the back too. Wow. And my hair does feel really soft too. So there are still a little bit um, a few tangles left here at the roots of my hair, but this did amazing work within 10 minutes. And I'll just give you a close up here. It feels really, really soft, still smelling great. And I forgot to show you all, this is all that I used. I hope you can see that on the camera, but like, there's still so much left, so I will definitely get a few more uses out of this product for the sample size. So definitely happy about that. And then even though we have, oh gosh, what did I do here? All right, there we go. Even though, oh gosh, you could probably hear that car. Um, even though most of the tangles are gone, I just want to make sure that we are detangling all the way through. So just going to go through really quickly with the tangle teaser. This did such good work, oh my gosh. It's just like pretty much gliding through my hair. And I did not detangle my hair at all throughout the washing process or when I put the conditioner in my hair, so this is definitely going to help you to keep your hair from breaking. And as of right now, I'm thinking that I definitely will repurchase or purchase this product for the first time and use this longer to see how my hair changes over time. Depending on whether it makes my hair too heavy when I'm styling it. So I will definitely um, show you all my hair once I have done, once I've styled it. 
Sorry, trying to do two things at once here, and I've never been good at that. All right, and that's it. My hair is already detangled, so I'm ready to rinse this out. And I will show you all what it looks like once it's rinsed out. And then I'll style my hair and come back on once my hair is dry. So I will see you again in a couple minutes. All right, so I rinsed the product completely out of my hair now, and this is what it looks like. It's soaking wet, so it is dripping down my back and it's so cold, so I do want to show you all really, really quickly what it looks like, but it feels really soft. It doesn't feel like it's too heavy, so I'm really excited to see what my hair looks like after I put product in it and style it. So I did make sure that I rinsed my hair out for a couple of minutes with cool water to make sure everything was out of my hair because you don't want to leave any of it left over in your hair as you are styling it. One, it's just going to be too heavy to do that. And then um, it can really change your results if it is still in your hair. So you wanna make sure that it is totally out of your hair before you go on to styling it, which I am about to do right now. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and style it. I'll let it dry and then I'll pop on to show you all what it looks like. Okay, so my hair is completely dry now and I hope you can tell that the product did not weigh my hair down. I think I got really good volume. I think my hair feels very soft. It looks and feels moisturized. So I'm definitely loving the results that I got from this hair mask and the styling products that I use today. I know that I did not show the styling products or the shampoo and conditioner that I use today. So I will link to everything in the description box so you can easily find those products if you want to check out what I use to get these results. But I will have to say I'm definitely going to buy the hair mask after I finish this sample so I can continue to use it and see if it helps to retain length and strengthen my hair. So I will definitely record an update later on. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on that video and other future videos. And I hope this one was really helpful for you. If it was, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And as always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.